boys and girls, let's take a stroll down memory lane and listen to a story. We have pictures because pictures always make story time more fun. This is the story of two presidential candidates and their very different lives that have led them to where they are today. Here we have a young Mitt Romney, born into a wealthy and privileged family. Young, young Mitt spent his youth in country clubs on the golf course wearing expensive suits and being groomed to follow in his father's footsteps of wealth and political power. Next, we have a young Ron Paul, who grew up in his father's small dairy business, delivering newspapers, mowing lawns, working at a local drugstore, working as a painter and a furniture mover. He saved up money from an early age and used it to begin his college education. During the Vietnam War, a young Mitt Romney spent his time protesting against the anti-war protesters. Luckily, he had plenty of time to tell others that they should go to war since he was exempt thanks to his position as a Mormon missionary. When he wasn't scolding others for not wanting to be sent to war, he spent his time, free time riding his bike around France. He found at the time that it really helped him take his mind off the thousands of his peers who were dying in a jungle in Southeast Asia. During the same time period, Ron Paul was serving as a flight surgeon with the United States Air Force. It wasn't easy for him since he had a wife and two small children at home, but when he was called to serve, he did. Mitt spent his time in the private sector working for consulting and investment companies, many times buying out companies, firing all their workers, and selling off the assets. Oh sure, some people lost their jobs, but Mitt sure did make a lot of money he was really good at making money. In fact, I guess you could say that he liked doing that more than just about anything. He was so good at making money that he's worth over $250 million now. So you know he can really relate to the rest of us. Well, the rest of us that are worth a quarter billion dollars anyway. Mitt Romney's co-workers really liked him a lot because he always put making money above everything else and they all got really rich too. Just look at how happy they all are with all that money. Ron Paul spent his time in the private sector as a doctor, an OBGYN to be exact. He delivered over 4,000 babies. Ron Paul's co-workers and patients loved him too, not because he made them all rich, but because he routinely provided discounted and free care to those who couldn't afford it. He even refused to accept Medicare or Medicaid as payment, choosing instead to work for free. Silly Ron, he could have made a whole lot more money if he didn't have all those principles. All right, boys and girls, I think that's enough story time for today. Maybe next time I'll tell you the story of their political careers and how they clashed clashed head to head in a political battle. Better yet, go to google.com or youtube.com and type in Ron Paul and do the research for yourself.